I read a very bothersome news report about an 11-year-old kid from North Carolina named Michael Moronis. I think that's how his name is pronounced. Forgive me if it isn't. It's either Moronis or Marones. I think I'm going to stick with Marones because it's easier to say. But he is a self-proclaimed fan of My Little Pony, which is a TV show. It's a, it's a cute TV show. I've watched it before. And um, he has ADHD, and he relates to the show very well. He particularly relates to a character called Pinkie Pie from the show. Well, he went to school wearing some uh, My Little Pony paraphernalia, and he started getting bullied from other people, um, being called gay and being called girly because he likes a movie or a show that's supposedly meant for girls, not for boys. So, in st like, after being bullied to a certain extent, he decided to go home one day. He didn't go to any of his extracurricular activities, and he tried to hang himself because he was really bothered by the bullying that he was experiencing. And now he is basically comatose and recovering from his attempted suicide. And my point is, this is an 11-year-old kid. Why is this... T why is this happening? To an 11 year old kid it should not be happening like this kind of bullying is ridiculous the heart of the problem is the fact that the bullying happens based on gender stereotypes clearly in their opinion liking my little pony as everything contrary to being a man you're an 11 year old kid seriously like are you 11 year old kids why are you worrying about what is a man and what is a woman like honestly at that point in your life you should not be caring let alone acting on it. And it just goes to show you that our society needs to remove its head from its ass and start realizing that these archaic gender stereotypes that we all abide that we all abide by is what's destroying people's lives because it it ostracizes people. Don't get me wrong, like I have bet fallen prey to uh people making assumptions based on gender stereotypes very frequently. My heart goes out to Michael and his family, and I hope he makes a complete recovery, and I know he's going to grow up to be a wonderful, amazing person. And to the people who decided to bully him, you really need to examine why you decided to make that decision. I think there is some sort of insecurity deep within you that convinced yourself to put someone else down and make them feel insecure, too. So the quicker you resolve that insecurity, the more happy, the happier you will be in life. And I think this just goes to show us all that as a society we need to break away from gender stereotypes because we're evolving to a point in our culture where gender doesn't necessarily define a person completely. Um, but yeah, if you would like, please comment, rate, and subscribe to my channel and follow my Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, and Pinterest in the link section below. You guys have a good day.